Alright, uh, Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh My name is Amirul Shahid And today I'm gonna present For the lab assignment uh, number 8 Which is clustering So, right now I'm uh, just gonna short uh, Introduction Using a candy data set Create a clustering model using rapid miner So uh, this is the final result that I got and we're gonna start from the number one which is blank space and then go to the operator and then I'm gonna search for read sorry read CSV uh, make sure it is connected because at this uh, I'm sure that I'm gonna click this button search for the data set called candy this one candy.csv double click it uh, and then when you run uh, at first i was shocked that i got this uh, example set like this because it is so messed up and go back to the design uh, go to the parameter column separator semicolon uh, so i'm going to change it to the comma because we want to uh, the attribute make, uh, make one by one uh, which is like this I'm run it, there you go I have competitor name like uh, here chocolate, fruity, caramel, peanut, blah 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 and there you go sugar percent, price and win percent we go to the statistic competitor name is polynomial integers and real real is because oh sorry is because they have a lot of number integers is because just one and zero so next i'm gonna store this uh, data set which is this to in the rapid miner what i'm gonna use the operator is store uh, sorry store there you go drag it put it here store go to the local repository go to the data and i name it as a candy so in here i'm gonna just delete it because i already have the data set sorry this one make sure it is connected if you guys uh don't believe it there you go same the data set and go to statistics still same mm -hmm. and then what the first thing that I need to do is I'm gonna remove this competitor name from this example set because a competitor competitor's name is a polynomial and the data is about the num the tax which is for the clustering it is not gonna use this attribute so what I'm gonna do is go to the operator here so search for select attribute put it here and to the parameter uh, this uh, why I'm I'm using this operator because uh, I'm just gonna select a subset of attribute and remove the other attribute. How? Uh, okay, let me show you. Go to the parameter attribute filter type. I'm gonna select a single and go to competitor's name. Make sure you invert selection because if you click run, I'm gonna just gonna include special attribute uh, if you don't want to also can but I'm just gonna it's gonna result show like this competitor's name which is this attribute that we want to remove so right uh, click the invert selection which is we are gonna remove the competitor's name there you go no more competitors name so we just gonna concentrate on next step 
so next I'm just gonna go with clustering clustering came in here operator all right this operator is to perform clustering using k-means algorithm all right the name is clustering but you uh, the parameter is k-mean there so first of all you need to add cluster attribute and add as label because in our data set we don't have label and uh, cluster attribute okay k is the centroid uh, i choose five this one max run is number of iteration that we want to perform so 10 and the others major type is numerical measures numerical measure is Euclidean distance all right and we move uh first but first we gonna click run there you go uh cluster zero one two three four all right we select k as five so it starts from the zero zero uh, one two three four five so k is total is five okay and then we can uh, execute the operator name as uh wait i forgot oh sorry sorry it's okay it's okay i'm gonna name it operator as distance sorry performance performance distance cluster distance performance sorry this one this operator is used for performance evaluation of centroid based clustering method also deliver a list of performance criteria values based on cluster centroid so cluster make sure it is acts like this and make sure it is connected like this for this uh, leave it as uh, default and i'm gonna run it like this which is you have the result like this and this id and label is created because in the operator of clustering we click add cluster attribute and add as label that's why he created itself for like this okay eh, okay we go to the cluster model and description for cluster zero we have 12 item one cluster one we have 15 cluster two we have 21 cluster three we have nine and cluster four we have 28 we add all this cluster and we get this 85 which is we have the 85 example oh, sorry and we move to the central table which is this one we learn, we're gonna look for chocolate cluster zero we we the 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 cent the central is 0 0.83 which is uh choc for chocolate for centroid for cluster zero is 0 0.8 and we look to the cluster number three which is one which is chocolate for cluster three cluster three is the 100 percent chocolate right and we go to the next fruity for cluster three it is not a fruity okay and we move to the uh heart is it hard is it hard or something like a uh, soft for cluster zero it is not hard it is soft same goes to the cluster three 
and bar note bar and there you go uh i think that's all for me madam thank you so much and have a good day thank you